Okay, so I'm going to kind of explain to you guys the um, graduate school acceptances and interview database that I'm working on. Um, basically, UHS keeps a list called like the Dixie Accepted Students um, for each um, each semester and it's in the shared G drive and there will be another video on how to access that information but in the G drive it's the Dixie accepted students in whatever semester um, so then you'll need to kind of just look at all the appliers there the pre-appliers people that um, may you know may or may not have applied but we got to get their contact information um, and we reach out to them via email and just kind of send them a formal email um, I did it all through my own email but it's still very professional and formal. Just send them out an email, say, hey, um, th I'm a peer mentor. This is what I'm doing. I'm trying to update this list. Have you applied? Where did you apply? Um, basically, the questions you need to ask them are where they applied, um, where they were accepted, rejected, or waitlisted, you know, whatever, um, where they interviewed, when they interviewed, and, um, let's see. Oh, and you also need to g ask them for a copy of their application, their formal application. So basically then what you do is there's a database, there's a shared um, Google Excel sheet, whatever, Google Doc thing, um, so I don't know. This is for the 2020-2021 cycle. I'm sure there will be a new one. Um, but all these names, you may have to go in and put them in, but um, all these names are here from all the from that other list, the G Drive list. Um, and you'll just write where they applied. So like I said, like their name, interviews, dates, so where and when. Um, status means accepted, rejected, or waitlisted. Um, and then you just put a Y next to where um, they're going to be attending. So here we have our medical one. Here's our dental. So you can see like here's a wait list. Um, here they declined the interview altogether. 